Now we are going to see solve using short division. First question, a question 66 is divided by 6. This is a short division method. Okay. Now 66 is a dividend. I'll write this is a dividend. Okay. 66 is a dividend. And 6 is a what? Divisor. Okay. Now 66 is going to be divided by 6. Okay. Now we, we are going to use what? Short division method. It is not a long division method. So all using what? Short division method. It is a short division. Okay. So you must use the sixth table up to 66. So first you must take what? 6. First 6 you have to take. This is 1s and 10s. You must take 6 10s. Is going to be divided by 6. 6 and 6. So compare with 6 and 6. So both are equal. It is not less than or greater than. Both are equal. So 6 is going to be divided by 6 means you can get 6 into 1. You can get 6. So 1. Okay. Next. After that, that means 6 1s are 6. 6 1s are 6. So you have to write what? Next digit you have to bring down. Because there is no reminder. Because the reminder is 0. 6 1 6 1s are 6. That means 6 after that what you are going to do? 6 minus 6 you can get 0. Right? So you must assume everything in the mind it seems. Next digit. So first digit is 0 means you have to bring down the next digit. So that is also compared with. That is 1s also compared with 6. So 6 is again going to what? Compared with 6. Both are equal. Again 6 1s are what? 6. 6 1s are 6. So this is a what? Quotient. Q U O T I E N T quotient. That you know it. Okay. So what is this answer? Solve using solve using short division methods. So this is a quotient. The remainder you know that zero only. So this is the answer. For sixty six is going to divide it by six. The answer is what? Eleven. Eleven is the right answer for this. So eleven is a quotient for this. What question? So second question, B question, now we are going to solve. Okay, B question, that is 72 is going to be divided by 8. Okay, 72 is going to be divided by 8. So, we must write 72 and 8. Okay, so first what you are going to do is a short division method I told you. So, you have to do some subtraction in the mind it seems okay 72 is going to divide it by 8 so what are you going to do first you have to this is ones and this is tens and two ones and seven tens this is called a 72 so 72 is going to divide it by 8 first you have to compare the tens seven tens is going to compare with 8 so that means 7 is compared with 8 7 is what less than 8 7 is less than 8 so it's not enough to divide. So what you're going to do, you have to take the next, you have to go to the next digit. Otherwise, you have to move on to the next digit. That is once you have to go to the next ones. That is two ones. So seven tens and two ones. That is called as 72. So now 72 is greater than 8. So now it's enough to divide. Okay, it's enough to divide. So you must use the word table, 8 table. So 8 table, you must say how many times up to 72 times. So you must say the 8th table, that is 8 1s are 8, 8 2s are 16, 8 3s are 24, even though I will write no issues. So 8 1s are 8, so 8 2s are what? 16, so 8 3s are what? 24, 8 4s are what? 32, 8 5s are 40. 8 6 sa 48 8 7 sa 56 8 8 sa 64 8 9 sa 72 okay 8 6 sa 48 8 7 sa 56 8 8 sa 64 8 9 sa 72 so 8 9 sa 72 so 9 is a what quotient 9 is a what quotient quotient this is dividend and this is a divisor 
ओके डिविडेंट डिविडेंट क्यू यू ओ टी आई ई एन टी क्वेश्चन एंड दिस इज अ वॉट डिवाइस सो फॉर दिस क्वेश्चन सेवेंटी टू इज डिविडेड बाई एट द आंसर इज वॉट नाइन आंसर इज वॉट नाइन सो नाइन इज अ राइट आंसर फॉर द वॉट बी क्वेश्चन सो सेवेंटी टू इज डिविडेड बाई एट द आंसर इज वॉट नाइन सो नाइन इज अ राइट आंसर फॉर द क्वेश्चन ओके आई थिंक सो यू अंडरस्टैंड द शॉर्ट डिविशन क्लियरली 